More than 20 schools from northern Minnesota were on the Bemidji State University campus today for the annual Creativity Festival. Lakeland News reporter Sherelle Moore has the highlights from the kids' point of view in this week's Golden Apple. Welcome to the Creativity Festival. The event has been going on for close to 20 years now, and each year gets bigger and better. Well, it's so fun to watch them walk down the hall because a lot of them have never been in a college setting. So they walk into this coming from a small rural school and they think, wow, this is just awesome. 25 different schools from all over northern Minnesota braved the elements to attend the festival held at Bemidji State University. This year, there were 17 different sessions meant to immerse students in the world of art, science, and animals. In Amazing Animals, we learned about some animals like um, snakes, legless lizards, salamanders. I went to mixed media dolls and there you take like blocks of wood and you get magazines and you can glue it on there. You can put beads and different things on there. I took a photography one and we learned how to like use the cameras and um, we took pictures of like flowers with like dew drops and like sand and shells. And I think young people love being challenged and, and what we're hoping to teach them is that process of giving them constraints and a problem and constraints or limitations and just letting them work their magic. The festival started because schools wanted something for kids that would be hands on, but also something they would learn from. I learned that it's better to take drawing by step by step instead of trying to just go, trying to do it all at once. I learned Newton's Three Laws of Motion. 500 kids from 30 different schools started their day off right here in this auditorium. They spent their day learning, socializing, and of course creating. Two, one, come on! Holy. My favorite was the fireball explosion, but break dancing it was fun, like learning different kind of dancing moves. The festival will be back at BSU next year. Until then, organizers are already planning. Always looking for new sessions, so if anybody knows creative people up in northwest Minnesota that want to work with kids, they can give us a call at the service co-op. Reporting of Bemidji with this week's Golden Apple, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.